Hello everybody. Today I'm going to teach you how we can model domes in SketchUp. For this, we are using an extension called Extrude Tools. This is a free extension. I'm adding a link in the video description. So let's get started. For creating a dome, we need a circle. For now, I'm taking a 5000 mm diameter circle. Then by selecting the whole circle, right click on it and click on find center. Then you can create a vertical line with the same dimension 5000 mm. Join the two edges with arc command to make a profile. You can make the adjustments as per your requirement. You can also check the shape by using the follow me tool. After this process, you have to delete the surface and use the rotate tool to make a copy of a line. After that, you just have to select the two arches and the bottom arc and make a copy of that too. Then you have to use the extension extrude tool and click on extrude edges by rails to lattice and the tool will ask you to select profile which in our case is the bottom curve after that select the rail which in our case is the vertical curves at last it will ask you to select the melting profile for that you have to again select the bottom curve then it will ask you to select the lattice form which in our case is the profile hash rails and select lattice type as 3D. After then, you can erase the coplanar edges or you can keep the edges as per your need, as per your design. Now, this will ask you the dimension for lattice. As per your requirement, this will help us to make a glass surface. It will again ask you to remove or keep the original curve. You can either keep it or erase it. After that, simply use the rotate tool and make three copies of this particular shape. Here you get the dome itself. You can also use the same process for the skeleton loop dome. In this case, we are using the default properties. To that, you can use the same process by using a rotate tool and making three copies of this particular shape. You can also make a simple dome by selecting the circular base and using the follow me tool. I hope this video helps you a lot. If you like the video, you can hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more upcoming videos like this.